Jai Guru Ji, uh, Shukrana Guru Ji, and uh, this is more or less uh, in continuation with what Seema Aunty was telling, uh, that how he protects us. And first of all, you have to thank you all for all of your thanks and thanks to your Guru Ji. What I am going to share, you know, and most of you have not seen me here, um, very few times, maybe uh, like two years ago. So, but two years ago, I moved to West Coast. Um, I used to come here, not very often again. And mera jo jana hota hai, wo mostly bade mandir ya fir dugri jana hota jab bhi main India jata hu. Or I make sure I always go there. But normally mandir mein no, very rare. So, it's a little different the way it works with me and. How am I connected? And that also I'll tell you. Personally, what I believe is because I was born in 1980, <clears throat> and the date of birth, the total adds to seven. When I first, you know, uh, took my conscious when I was three years old, the house that I was living in was 1753, the house number, adds to seven. The next house that I moved to 1789, that adds to seven too. So the blessings and the connection has been since 1980 with Guruji. And the confirmation was received in 2019 by Raj Aunty, who is sitting over here. Something happened. I had to be in India. And she said that she had a dream and where she was, where Guruji told her that he has blessed me. That point of time, I wouldn't really believe, you know, what she's saying and why me, you know. So he had to find a way, you know, he has to come in the life and he has to say that this connection is there now. And then how he manifests that in coming three years, four years is, you know, seen by what I did in my life, you know, how I progress and how I, you know, able to move from one place to another, which, you know, apparently I did well. So whatever happened, you know, is, is a course of things. So I, I'm connected with uh, Ashwini uncle as well, you know, deeply since 2005. And we talk to each other a lot. Uh, but ever since I moved to West Coast, that has reduced, obviously, because I'm physically not here. So as a both incident to way, and uh, in my previous satsang, I shared that as well. Now, What I want to say, you know, how uh, he protects you. So no matter how he blesses you, you know, you could be coming here in the temple as many times as you want to, or like me, who's not coming in the temple, but he's always remembering Guruji and always being thankful for whatever he's doing to you. You still need his protection. So we were just listening to a satsang where he says, uh, Apuran, you know, ek insan jo hota hai, it's, uh, he's not complete, he makes mistakes. And all of us do that, no matter what stage of our life we are, we make mistakes. Whether we are young, whether we are old, we will continue to do that. And our goal is that we reach towards that perfection, which is not easy to achieve. When you make mistakes, you pay the price. Like Guruji, there are other, you know, powers in the world who can hurt you when you make mistakes. But he is there to protect you from those evil powers. There are no powers that can affect you and hurt you if you're not making mistakes. So one of those incidents In Seattle, where I live right now, so I, we invited a family. We said that, you know, why don't you guys come over? So they said that, okay, you know, everything was planned. And then suddenly they said that, you know, we have some of the families visiting from parents and their parents visiting from India, and they have come here. And why don't you guys join us and come in, um, you know, spend time with us? So, okay, so we said, okay, you know what, uh, whatever we have prepared, let's just take that to their home, you know, and we'll... Uh, Try to cherish that over there. So, uh, there are some families, hai, approximately 20-25 people, hai, we are gathering. 
एंड वट इज है कि सब लोग बैठे हैं इट्स अ समर टाइम लाइक अभी अबाउट टू मंथ्स गो तो everybody's outside the weather is very nice seattle is uh, known to be a little unpredictable in weather because uh, it's uh, uh, you know it gets rainy and suddenly it gets cold as well to hum bahar baithe hain humne summer hamara chal raha hai aur sab aaram se sab kuch acha chal raha hai and then everybody's enjoying so suddenly when as the sun starts setting it starts getting colder so most of the people about from 25 people i would say 20 of them moved inside All the ladies moved inside. Kids have started playing. So, जो लोग बाहर बैठे थे, उनके लिए हमने क्या किया कि the host mainly uh, he turned on the um, uh, he had like this small setting where you know you can turn on the fire pit, which is being operated by gas, and that fire pit is about you can say uh, two feet high, about this high, and it had those uh, pebbles in it, and that fire pit he has not serviced and that can happen to any one of us you know we have our house we don't sometimes we not always taking care of things before we invite people in he had not serviced that thing so and he also said that ki hua kya tha beech mein ki a bottle of beer fell into it and because of which it clogged some of the pores through which gas comes out which burns the fire तो उसकी वजह से जो जब उन्होंने उसको टर्न ऑन किया तो वो अच्छे से गैस जल नहीं रही थी और देर वॉज अ विंड दैट वॉज कमिंग इन माई डायरेक्शन एंड वी वर आउट लाइक टू पीपल से रिंग एंड थ्री ऑफ दैम इंक्लूडिंग द होस्ट स्टार्टेड फिगरिंग आउट कि इसको कैसे अच्छे से बर्न किया जाए ताकि सब लोग बाहर आ जाए तो मैं क्या करता हूँ कि आई एम सिटिंग इन द कॉर्नर ऑफ द सीट एंड द सीट वेयर अदर पीपल वर सिटिंग विच वॉज द लाइन ऑफ फायर people have moved inside and i moved from the corner of the seat over to where the line of fire was and the gas i can smell it's coming towards me and i feel like i should get up and move because it's dangerous so i don't know how many have you really seen a blast like a bomb blast like a small level bomb blast in the moment that i thought that i should move in the next second the blast occurred and you can say that like let's say this room you, you know cut this room into half the size and if you see the fire because the gas when it leaks you know the gas settles down and it's heavier than the air it stays below and that has not spread out luckily enough to make the blast go above the level where you're sitting to wo jo fire thi wo aise thi ki jo deck hai wo pura fire mein covered tha jo maine dekha i was about 4 uh, or 5 feet away from that thing and there was another uncle sitting over there he was wearing socks and you know i was wearing jeans but i was not wearing socks you go to somebody's house you don't put socks on you know so when the fire came when the blast occurs it's just a matter of like 2 to 3 seconds that you have to react whether you step back or you're caught in the fire and anything can go wrong right from there that point onwards to mera jo natural reaction tha was ki jo mera pair aage tha i just pull my feet back because i could see the blast happening and because of the chair that i was sitting on it was a cane chair and it had a cane all the way to the bottom of it the damage on my right foot was it had a burn and it scraped the skin from this part about 2 to 3 inches of skin was scraped and then there was a burn on the right side of the foot और जो अंकल बैठे थे उन्होंने सॉक्स डाली हुई थी तो आई डोंट नो आई मीन ही सेड दैट कि इज फीलिंग लिटिल यू नो हॉट एंड ऑल दैट बट आई टुक द मेजर ब्रंट ऑफ द फायर अमंग ऑल 25 पीपल एंड इमेजिन आई मूव फ्रॉम दैट चेयर टू हेयर जस्ट टू टेक दैट फायर अपॉन मी अच्छा तो ये होने के बाद ना ये हो गया चलो मीन वी डिड नॉट कॉल नाइन वन वन आई टुक इट लाइक की 
let's not make a big deal of it. You know, you are at friend's house. Especially, you know, among us in our Desi community, we feel like, you know, let's not, like, I told uh, the host as well, I said that, you know, had it been any other, like a normal American person you had invited and had he been hurt, he'll make sure that he asks you what kind of insurance you have. Because he's going to do whatever he has to, you know, and claim whatever claim he has to make. So I said, Ki chalo, you know, family, hai, friends, hai, you know, just keep it light, low profile. I didn't realize the, the intensity of damage I had on my feet, on my foot, actually, one of them only. So we go home, and, you know, I, I, I feel like I did sleep through, like, maybe two, three hours. I wake up. When I wake up, I could see, you know, when a burn happens on your skin, you get a bubble on the skin because there's a water on that. So the whole foot on the right side of it had a bubble. The skin that had scraped had a wound, and I had to go to the hospital because I couldn't take it from there. Yes, there was a burning pain, and there was a scrape that had happened as well. I go to the doctor, and she looks at it, and she says, the first question doctor asks you is, what happened? And then you tell the story. With their experience, doctors can tell ki what a damage is and what could have really happened. She said, this is a second to third degree, in between second to third degree burn. Third degree burn is when your muscles are also burned. So this has touched the muscles, but not got in there, but it burned everything. And I'm like, uh, she said, the kind of scene that you're uh, telling me, you know, for what has happened, I cannot believe that you came out of that fire and 911 was not called in and ambulance was not there at that time. She's surprised and I'm like, okay, what do we do next now? So she's like, you would have to be sent to the wound care. They would have to examine it. Uh, if there is a debris, you know, of whatever has happened. So what could Joby could show you know who's then I'm Papa's age hospital say you know antibiotics the or on a bola key up job her pay or a be next you know appointment kill you have go won't get the Jana Padega or the Hana Padega you work at a child yes up to who are then you know when you sit alone you know everybody the kids are back to school you know we are in we anyways we are working from home and we are at work you know you tend to forget you know what could have been the damage. But then you start thinking that in the last 25, 25, 30 years, you haven't been hurt by any single thing. Nothing has happened to you. But then why this suddenly? These kind of questions starts coming into your mind. Like, we are not kids. And we are not that adventurous that we will end up hurting ourselves. You're not hiking, you're not, you know, trying to do something that you've never done before. Then why this suddenly? And that too with me, when there are 25 other people sitting who moved inside and I moved from another seat to this seat to come in the line of fire to take that brunt on me. So yeah, questions children, I said, yeah, Guruji said, I mostly said that I never asked him anything because the kind of connection I have is that I know that whatever is going to happen and he's going to take care of it automatically. But like I said, you know, when you make mistakes, you pay for it. So there were some thoughts and I'm okay to admit at this time, and you guys have to listen to this, that there were some thoughts that were going through my mind during the time I got hurt, which were not good thoughts. You're thinking about something or you're thinking about someone and you being in that selfish or mean state of mind, which has consequences. It doesn't matter, you know, you're a five-year-old, you're eight-year-old, these things continue to happen, and this is where he comes in. Now, how he provides the evidence and how he proves it, that how he protected you. So while I'm thinking of this, it's been like two, three days. 
तो अश्विनी अंकल का मुझे मैसेज आया ना लाइक अ सेड यू नो वी आई एम इन वेस्ट कोर्स इन ही इज हेयर सो वी बेयरली टॉक राइट बिकॉज ऑफ इन लॉन्ग डिस्टेंस रिलेशनशिप सो ही सेंड्स मी फ्यू पिक्चर्स ऑफ गुरु जी एंड टेक एन ड्यूरिंग द सत्संग एट समबडीज हाउस एंड ही सेज दैट डू यू रिकोगनाइज एनीथिंग इन इट हम लाइक ओके यू नो नॉर्मली वट हैपन्स इज हम जब भी पिक्चर्स देखते हैं गुरु जी की तो हम स्टार्ट लुकिंग इन टू कि कहीं पर ओम बना हुआ है कहीं पर जैसे अंकल बता रहे थे कि उनकी चेयर है उनका दब जाता है तो पता लगता है गुरु जी बैठे हुए तो आई स्टार्ट लुकिंग इन टू ईच एंड एवरी डिटेल्स हम लाइक यार कुछ नजर तो आ नहीं रहा है ना मुझे कहीं ओम दिख रहा है ना कुछ तो मैंने कहा नहीं मुझे नहीं समझ में आया कि क्या है इसके अंदर तो बैक इन 2019 थाउजेंड एंड दिस इज ओनली वंस एंड द लास्ट टाइम दैट आई हैव डन 2019 आई वेंट टू इंडिया रश्मि आंटी से ब्रिंग इन चोलास फ्रॉम इंडिया फॉर मी बिकॉज आई नीड आई ब्रिंग इन टू चोलास गुरु जीस एंड वन ऑफ द चोलास आई से दैट यू नो आई एम गोना कीप इट फॉर मी सो आई डोंट वॉन्ट you to pay me for that so i have this chola but i leave it to rashmi aunty and i say that you can use it later um so my wife still is not into guru ji at this time so we don't even do satsangs at home or wherever you know we still connect i'm still connected she gets to use this chola from 2019 he says Ashwini uncle is telling me that this chola is the one that you brought in 2019 is the one what which is guruji is wearing during this satsang so i'm like okay so he says i said okay when was the satsang he says satsang was on sunday and then he tells me the story behind it before he starts i tell him that you know we haven't been in touch you know so it's been few weeks but i got into an accident on sunday so he said what happened and while i'm telling him the story he asked me about the timeline he says west coast 6 pm is when the accident happened he said 9 pm east coast is when he was putting this chola why was he putting this chola he said he had an extra chola at that time but the satsang where the satsang was happening they had their own chola they were saying ki hum pehle ye pehnate hain to jab wo pehna rahe the to that was you know he can probably explain it better the way he saying is ki wo jab pehna rahe the to unko pehnane ke baad aisa lag raha tha ki guru ji ke jaise aap pattiyan laga rahe ho and he said the same word to them ki bhai aap guru ji ke pattiyan kyon laga rahe ho unke koi chot thodi lagi hai this was 6 pm in pst when i got hurt and 9 pm in est when he was doing this he said ki wo ho gaya patti wala ab aap iske upar ye wala chola pehnao that same chola that i had brought from 2019 from india is what he was doing so that really when i listen to that when i heard that you know that really tells me was that the way of him protecting me from that line of fire which even doctor is surprised to hear how did you happen to have come out from that without getting hurt as much acha jo chot lagi thi usme sirf yahi tha ki i just have to keep my feet above level of my heart so that the blood doesn't flow in there and it won't hurt the moment i put my feet down and i start walking it will start hurting so for the duration of my recovery i just had to stay like that for 3 weeks so yes you are blessed you know you may have lot of things you may have to come here to seek the blessings when you make mistakes that's what my experience is and i firmly believe that it is true because he has proven it with his presence and with his, the examples that he gave when you make mistakes you're going to pay for it but to the extent that you're going to pay for depends on how he comes and rescues you from it which is what was displayed that maybe i was there to protect others 25 other people that could have been a accident site when that happened so he put me over there to go and do that and then he rescues me from it 
But it happened to me after 25, 30 years, maybe 35 years, when we used to be kid and we would hurt ourselves. Why did it happen all of a sudden? Because yes, you make mistakes. And then you ask for forgiveness. And that's what I did. I did not realize at that time there was a mistake. This is another thing. We do something, we don't know what we After a few years, maybe after a few days, few months, we realize that, oh, this is how it is related. And then he again comes and tells you that, yes, this is what it was. But I was there to save you. I got two other incidents I have to tell you, you know, very quickly that happened in one after another. So my daughter, when we were in India, she hurt herself and then we had to take her to the ortho, you know, because US kids are not really uh, adaptive to how Indian environment is. So whenever they go there, they end up either getting sick or they end, end up getting hurt. So she hurt her foot, she slipped, and we had to take her to ortho. That was Chandigarh's best ortho doctor, and you can say that he has a, a, you know, expertise in knee replacement and everything. So, and I'm telling my wife, you know what, I have an issue with my left arm, which happened because, you know, during the gym, you know, I was pushing some weights and all that, and this hurts. Most of the time it hurts, and it's weaker than my right arm. So, uh, Menegaki, I told my wife that, you know, we are getting to see my daughter over here. Why not I also go and do that? She said, okay, you know, go for it. So, the doctor over diagnosed that one of my, you know, your, your body is made of uh, nerves, muscles, flesh, you know, and all that, and bones. Nerves are the ones which are connected to your brain. They tell whether if you get a hurt sensation or, you know, burn sensation and all that. There's an ulnar nerve that attaches from two of your fingers to your brain. He said your ulnar nerve is damaged. Diagnosis. He said he'll have to send me to the test. And I'm in India. He says that I'm going to have to go through surgery. Because, and he's, uh, like I said, he's a top doctor. He sends me to a place where they had to uh, test the nerve. You know, they put some electric signals and, you know, uh, through the brain and everything and all that. And... The guy who is testing, he's raising his eyebrows like this. You know, when he, he first tests your right arm, he sees that if it is, he puts the right arm as a benchmark, like the arm which is good. And then he says that, you know, okay, let me go through the left arm. When he does the, when he does the left arm, he sees that ki, there is an issue, and, you know, he's raising his eyebrows, and then he realizes, I said that, oh, something's wrong. So he says that the nerve sensation of your left arm is Right arm se to badiya hai ye, or in fact, meri arm ki kudki sensation se bhi jata badiya. So, well, what does that mean? Because doctor told me that you have a ulnar nerve damage. He said, I don't know why he sent you over here. So, I go back to the doctor, and doctor is clueless, speechless, and he's like, I don't know what happened, but jo test ke liye bheja tha mujhe, wo test ki report total negative. And then I go back home, and he says, I'm going to take medicine. Lik deta so I don't know what electric signals ki wajah se or whatever happened, I haven't felt that numbness or that sensation again. So jo, coincidentally, jo karwaya, jo ne, jaise bhi karwaya, wo bhi, you know, that was a, another thing. I'll just end this, uh, yeah, from here. Third one I cannot, maybe because of the, you know, amount of time we have. But this is, uh, I think, conclusion is that Yes, just stay connected. You know, he's always there to bless you and always seek his blessings. And uh, we do make mistakes and try to stay away from it and try to become as much perfect as you can. Thank you. Jai Guruji.